good morning everybody well welcome to daily vlog number 366 except it's no longer daily it's just gonna be my badger vlog i'll probably put them out a couple times a week um i'm contemplating a second tour of the daily vlog we'll see i'm still recovering from the first daily vlog but anyway we're out here at the track got a few people practicing um tomorrow is race day so for those of you that are just joining me two weeks ago i decided um with a crazy idea that i was going to get back into rc racing so i've always done nitro stuff i've done no electric stuff guess what i have an associated um buggy that's all electric so i'm learning a whole new thing but here it is there's the buggy and uh we're gonna knock out some practice today and see what we can do in a race tomorrow. So two weeks, I've owned the buggy. It went from being in a box to being put together to like three practice sessions to racing tomorrow. We'll see how it turns out. Let's go. All right, practice is over. As you can see, I'm in the Jeep, making sure that the, the Jeep is all fixed. I think it is, it's been running great. So I think I've got those problems. You can see I got a pit table back there, chairs, my, my bag with my car. I'm gonna go home, clean everything up, charge everything up, and uh, we'll see what we can do tomorrow racing. I felt really good in practice today. So um, once I see all the fast guys, I probably won't feel so good. But for right now, I feel great. We'll see what tomorrow brings. Anyway, we'll see you guys at the race tour. All right, the night before race, and I'm prepping. The buggy's all ready to go. The batteries are all charged. All the tools are packed. Um, I am ready. As ready as I think I am going to be, I need to be. Um, I will probably not have everything I need and uh, I'll forget something or you know how it is but anyway <sighs> tomorrow tomorrow's race day my first race in a long time I'm pretty excited about it I'm also pretty nervous about it but uh, it should be a good time I, I saw I met a couple guys there today that are coming to race tomorrow so yeah, so I got to meet a couple guys. Sorry, my battery died. I got to meet a couple guys today. They were great. Um, I think it's going to be a great time. Get to meet a bunch of new people. I don't know if I showed you guys this the other day, but I bought an actual RC bag. So it holds tools, as you can see. Inside, it actually holds the car. It's even got a strap to strap the car down. My radio goes in there. Um, Pretty neat little bag for, I want to say it was like 50 bucks. So, um, and it's black and orange. How do you beat that? Anywho, I think I'm going to uh, call it a wrap for tonight. We'll get up tomorrow and we'll go racing. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, everybody. It is race day and it's a little damp, a lot foggy. So this should definitely make it interesting. People are kind of setting up their tents and their pits. I did not bring a tent. Hopefully I don't regret that. But if I do, I do. Lessons learned for the next time. Anyway, I got my car pretty much set up last night, so I'm ready to roll. Everything's charged, and um, I'm ready to play. But yeah, we've got a, you can see the footprints in it. See, so it's a little bit damp. I have no idea how that affects the car, although I gotta imagine it definitely takes the grip away. Anyway, we'll see how the day turns out. Race day, here we go. The track is drying out, which is great, because I got on the track with it wet, and I was just spinning around. I'm like, all that practice basically wasted, because uh, 
it was wet and I had no idea how to control my car. Anyway, it's drying out. So watching the, the good guys run and uh, yeah, at least I'm learning some different lines. Oh, got a crash. I got gotcha. you. Do a little marshal in here too. All right, so they posted up the first heat. So looks like I'm in the first heat. See all those other four names? That's who all is going to beat me. And then they got 10th two-wheel drive buggy, 14th scale open, and 10th stadium truck. Oh, getting ready to race. All right, first heat race over. I actually got second. Everybody gets lucky once in a while. All right, so my first heat race is down. Um, like I said, I got second place. Um, I was two laps behind the guy that was leading. Um, but all in all, I'm pretty happy for my first ever heat race, two weeks after buying a brand new buggy and just starting to get a feel for it. So I'm pretty happy with my results. Um, they have another heat of our same style buggies going on now. I think this is the fast group. I was in this lower group. So um, we'll see where we all end up. Anyway, it's a good day. The sun came out, it's gotten hot, and uh, we're having a good time. All right, second heat was way worse. I was two laps short, shorter than I was on my first one. So I ended up fourth out of four, last place. One thing left. And that is the main. So, wish me luck. All right, time for the B main. Here we go. All right, here's the A main. Lined up and ready to go. All right, so my first race is over. Actually, it's Monday. So um, my first race was Sunday. There's the car. I'm out here in the garage. I'm getting ready to blow it off. You can see all the all the buildup dirt and stuff here, carpet. So I'm gonna go blow it off really good, clean it up, um, get ready for the next practice. So a few things I learned um, at this race. One, I had never seen any of the fast guys run, so I didn't know what the fastest line was. So I got to see how they were running their cars and the fastest line. So now I got to practice running that line so that I'm faster. Um, I ended up being about two seconds. My fastest lap was two seconds slower than their fastest lap. So I got about two seconds to make up. Now, I have very little practice with the car, as you guys know. Um, I have not changed the setup any because I just kind of went stock to see where I was at. So I've got some tweaking and some tuning and a lot of practice to do, but I had a blast. Um, and uh, I mean, I was only two seconds off. I ended up getting um, second place. Well, second to last place. <laughs> anyway, I had a blast um, and I really enjoyed the car. So I had a great time running the car and uh, I think uh, I think I'm gonna really enjoy this. And then this 10 scale car can actually be um, with a few changes can also be ran on a dirt track. So we got dirt tracks not too far from here. I think that would be fun as well. I don't know whether I get another one or I just swap parts and make this one like dual purpose. I'm, I'm undecided there, but anyway. Um, the other reason that you're seeing this on my Facebook is Mama Badger has forbidden me from making YouTube videos on my RC stuff. So if you wanna watch anything RC stuff, you're gonna have to come on my personal Facebook page. 
because she's like, if you do that, you're turning it into work and uh, you can't do that. This has to be your fun hobby and you can't make videos and you don't need to worry about recording stuff and yada, yada, yada. So I have been forbidden from making Facebook video, I mean YouTube videos about RC stuff. But she said I can take, make videos and put it on my Facebook page, which by God I'm gonna do. So anyway, um, enjoy the video little bit of footage from yesterday and uh, that's what I learned had a great time at my first race thanks for following along